Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes. I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. I just want to tell everybody, thank you so very much for being patient with me while I was on this little excursion in Jamaica. Um, thank you for not unfollowing me. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for all of those things that really fucking mean something on this goddamn here YouTube. Okay, so I don't want you guys to, um, to think that I don't notice, that I don't see. I, I want you to know that I'm highly, highly thankful. Okay? We're going to get into a quick message for Taurus while I pull on this hair split. You know what I mean? Now that I've been back for a few hours, I might end up quitting smoking because the weed here is so different that my body literally just can't even take it. It's You can literally taste the chemical made weed when you're in Jamaica. The weed is so pure and so different that when you come back here, it's like it tastes like poison. Anyway, moving on. Can I get a card, please? What is the most important messages, please, for Taurus? What is the most important messages, please, for Taurus? Taurus, you keep your phone on silent, or I feel like you should keep your phone on silent at night so you can um, rest better. I'm also getting, keep your phone away from your bed. Do not, if you sleep with your phone by your head, move it, okay? I'm hearing um, radio, the song Radioactive. I don't know why, but I just feel like move your phone away from your bed or away from your head, Okay? It has the ability to fuck up your eyesight or something like that. Or give you headaches. Moving on. Can I get cards please for Taurus? I'm also hearing a decision with an ear sign has not been made yet. Okay Taurus? Especially heavily emphasis on a Libra. Okay, but I also feel like when they do make the decision, it's going to go in your favor. I'm also getting that you're, you want to work something out with an air sign i'm also getting that you're making calls uh, you're looking for apartments or you're looking for a job you should get the call back in the next three days or three hours or by by if not by yeah if not yeah they keep pointing on the number three so it's something about three, three days, three hours. You just have to wait. Okay, Taurus. Now, somebody from, uh, I don't know. I feel like Taurus, there's someone that's in love with you, but they don't live in the same town, state, or country as you. I'm also getting that you may have to travel to meet the love of your life, your divine partner, your soulmate. Look at these cards. You're waiting for someone to come into your life, a divine love, but you have to travel, Taurus. I'm also getting that you you're you're being called to not How can I say this? Take on too much responsibility, especially especially in in regards to um financial. I'm also seeing that um it's time for you to move on. Stop waiting for this air sign or stop waiting for this air sign to commit to you, marry you, bring you children or whatever. I'm also getting Tyrus that you should be traveling for the next three years. All in when you don't have it like that. Make sure you try to travel to as many states, countries or towns, even if it's just a fucking town. Make sure you can get out to travel for the next three years or three months. I'm also getting, Taurus, someone's going to send you a text message that you've been waiting on. You've been waiting for someone to reach out to you, talk to you, or to make a final decision about something. Now, this could be your mother. You've been waiting for your mother. You've been waiting for your sister to reach out to you, to tell you that, uh, I don't know, whatever, whatever they're trying to make a decision on. Now, you may have to call your mother or your sister to tell them that you're moving, you're relocating from one state or one town to a next. Okay, but I'm getting that emotionally. It's a lot to take on because you, I, I feel like uh, it's something that you have to do. Okay, Taurus. Any more messages, please, for Taurus? Wow. I'm going to say it because that was very, very, very clear. I heard um, 
Mary J. Blige, I'm not gonna cry no more. Wow, I feel like I feel I'm not gonna shed a tear. No Yeah, I feel like I feel like you're gonna I feel like you you you're gonna call it a, a win lose situation. Or damn if I do, damn if I don't, so let me move on. And soon as you do, okay, Tyrus, you, you, I feel like soon as you do, or soon as you stop waiting on this fire sign or air sign, and you make the decision to move the fuck on, you're literally going to find your soulmate. I also heard Gemini has left the building. I'm hearing the song by Skilly Bang, Crocodile Teat. Some more grimy. So I feel like I feel like someone moves like a crocodile, sneaky. Calculated. Okay? Or this is what you're waiting to see, Tyrus. One card, please, for Tyrus. Thank you very kindly. So yeah, five of pentacles. I'm <laughs> Like I said, five of pentacles in reverse. Four of pentacles in reverse. It's a win-lose situation, so you give up. Hands up. Okay? I'm also seeing, Tyrus, you're, you're, you're about to take action to overindulge in yourself. I feel like some, some of you guys are going to go get your hair done, your nails done, buy you guys a nice little outfit. Now, if you're a man, you're going to go get a lineup. You know what I mean? You're about to go get spiffy. Okay, I, I, I'm getting that you guys are coming out of a, a spot of feeling um, broken heart. I'm, now I'm hearing um, Broken Hearted Girl by Beyonce, I think that is. No, Broken Heart. Broken Hearted Girl, I think that is. I feel like, I feel like you're letting shit go. I also, I feel like um, if you guys were holding a grudge with an Aries or, an, or um, a Cancer, I feel like, I feel like... Someone didn't even notice that you had a grudge, so let it go. Now this could be them to you. They didn't even know. You, they didn't even know that you don't give a fuck. Whatever your problem is, that's for your business. That, okay. I'm also getting that you're coming out of a period of isolation. Okay, you're coming out of a period of of feeling lonely and hurt by a third party situation or some type of argument and fight with the Sagittarius. Some of you guys are finding it difficult to find balance in your life because you are all alone. You don't have a lot of help. You you have about two to three children and you don't have a lot of financial help or you don't even really have family around that will help you. I feel like I hear someone say, man, I don't fuck with nobody. Okay, can I get a card at the top, please, for Tyrus? So I'm also getting, I'm also getting Tyrus, like, you're loyal to the thing. You know what I mean? Every time you give advice, it's truthful, honest advice. And it helps people. I'm also getting that some I'm I'm getting that uh, an Aquarius heavily emphasis on an air sign or a fire sign gave you advice in regards to you whatever your life situation is. It was the best advice that they could fucking give you. Especially when it was talking about other people and your money especially when it's talking about other people and 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 trusting your own intuition because i feel like someone said man don't fuck with them and you took that advice i'm also getting that make sure you take your own advice make sure you listen to your own intuition because i feel like people have the tendency to get you stuck in predicaments that you really don't want to be in taurus but if you just listen to your own high priestess, your own advice. I also feel like something that was said to you keeps replaying over and over in your head. Or I feel like something that was said to you in real life came to you in a dream, a confirmation in a dream for something that happened in real actual life. 
I would say that it will repeat itself again. Whatever this is, it will repeat again. You'll get another confirmation. It's gonna come in the form of a conversation. I feel like you. I feel like something's gonna happen. You had a dream about it, and then randomly, like someone, you hear someone talking about the same shit that happened to you, or you hear, you you randomly are having a conversation. Like it's so ironic. You know what I mean? I feel like it's gonna be con confirmed again, especially if you missed the first confirmation of that dream or whatever happened to you in the mundane world. Moving on. Especially if it's about someone cheating or why someone left you or vice versa. Especially uh, also if someone is literally trying to sabotage you. I'm also getting that there's people that they, they lie on you Taurus. They've lied on you. Or they've cheated on you. They've kept, they've kept a lot of secrets. I also get that every time this cancer or this um leo is around an air sign this could be your husband he starts acting weird different or sneaky can i get a card please at the top can i get one card thank y'all yeah and it's throwing it's throwing everything off i'm also getting that someone over ex Taurus, I feel like I feel like your finances is off because you're spending it on cheating or you're spending it on gambling. I I also feel like someone's love is invested with someone else. I'm also getting that someone's loved one is going to be getting out of jail in like five days or five weeks. On a sexual tip, because I am going to pick up those cards, I hear a uh, Spice's song. Mm, go down there. I'm hearing... Um, I'm hearing someone say, yo, give me some head or some shit like that. So, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm also getting that you're waiting too long to make a decision, Taurus. Especially in regards to a fire sign or an air sign, heavily emphasis on Libra. I'm getting that this person has cheated, threw you off financially, mentally, physically, and you still stick around. You're still loyal. When are you going to make a decision? I'm also getting that if you're waiting for a job, if you're waiting for a job to call you back, I feel like um, you will be getting a call back. It, uh, it's just, I don't know why it's taking so long. They're just, they're literally like trying to wait three weeks or three days um, to, to call these people about the job that they want, that they're hiring for it. Now, if, if for any reason that they're stalling out, it's because of the money at ratio. How much are we going to give these people? Okay, because I feel like minimum wage is like supposed to be like, I don't know, 10, 11, 12 dollars and they're still paying like eight, nine dollars. Somebody's looking for a job in the in the medical fields or someone's looking for a job that um, is not exactly close to them. So you may need you may need to save money or, or, or find a way to financially support yourself to get to this job. I'm also getting that it would be it would be the better idea that if you could find a job that a allows you to work in an instant to or work on a computer. Uh, I also feel like someone here is meant to be a caregiver to the elderly or to people in the hospital. So like a home health aide or a nurse's assistant or I feel like this could even be someone's life path is supposed to be like uh I don't know what part of the hospital you call that, but like you know when the when the mothers give birth, like I feel like part of your life calling is to work in that. I'm also here in infirmary, so I don't know what that means either. So I'm also hearing that that's supposed to be um, someone else's life path. I'm getting that Taurus, you're on the wrong life path. You 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 you're gone left when you're supposed to go right. Your 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 mission in this world is to birth children 
or work in a hospital, but you're doing something that's literally not on your fucking career path and you can't even see that because you're trying to hold on to what you feel like you're used to or you're trying to hold on to what you think what works for you, but your your karma here is to work in the medical field. But I feel like you're, you're trying to chase your dream of owning your own business. And the reason why it's not working out is because literally you're supposed to work in the medical field. Now, this could be you supposed to have a daycare as well. Maybe you're supposed to have a daycare. But whatever it is, it revolves you like you're supposed to be helping people to heal in some way. Okay, moving on from that message. Could you tell me about the five of pentacles? Three keeps showing up for you, okay, Tyra? So three is a prominent number. So there's an initiation or a beginning to something. Some of you guys could just um about to be finishing school or to, to be a nurse or to be a doctor. I'm also seeing the color white and red is very prominent. So these could be things that you have to work on in your um, chakra. I was about to say root chakra. So I'm getting that your root chakra needs to be worked on as well. Can I get a card, please, for the Five of Pentacles, please, for Taurus? Why is the Five of Pentacles here, please, for Taurus? Thank you. It says, just chill. I don't want this. Mm. So I'm also... I'm also seeing that someone is reaching out, um, out, reaching out to you and asking you if you would like to hang out, Netflix and chill. And I'm getting now uh, you're ignoring their phone calls. Like you're really not on that because I feel like this is a fire sign or an air sign that's like really on some bullshit. It's a waste of fucking time. I'm also getting that with the just chill. I don't want this, Taurus. I feel like. You have officially gone on chill mode. You are no longer dealing with nobody else's bullshit, okay? You, you're trying to get yourself back on track financially, physically. I'm also getting that if you're waiting to pay any type of bill, I, 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 feel, like, I feel like it's going to throw you off, okay, Taurus? Because I feel like um, you really don't have a lot of money to like fuck around with, okay? So if you have bills that need to be paid, pay them, okay? Can I get the King of Wands in the Judgment card? Why is the King of Wands here in the Judgment card? I'm also getting Tyrus that someone likes when you're on the phone with them and they like to play with their dick or some shit like that. I feel like someone's having phone sex. Can I get a card, please, for the King of Wands in the Judgment? Thank you. It says, on my way in wife. <sighs> so if someone is dealing with the Libra... If someone is dealing with a fire sign, I feel like someone's um, on your way to fuck your wife. Now, this could be one of these um, zodiacs. Not prominent. doesn't have to be. But, I mean, they could be a, a, a Libra or they could be a fucking uh, a Leo and they're on their way to fuck your wife or fuck your bitch. They've been fucking her. They've been having phone sex with her. Or him. Whatever. Can I get a card, please, for the King of Pentacles? Why is the King of Pentacles here? Ew. It says, be smart. Okay, make sure you wear a condom, okay? Okay, okay, okay. Why is the Three of Wands here? It says, you hurt me. Why? Like I said, make sure you be smart and wear a condom, especially if you fucking somebody else's spouse, okay? Because I feel like you really don't really want to commit to this person, so... I don't know why they're emphasizing that, but maybe that's important. Okay, the disrespect. Hold on, because I just picked those up like I was done. And I'm not. Can you tell me why the Five of Pentacles is here with the um, King of Pentacles in reverse? Why is the Five of Pentacles here? It says masturbate. Yeah, I feel like when you leave, when someone leaves, when someone leaves the house, someone starts masturbating. Versus phone sex. Like I said, I knew I seen that, right? I knew I seen it. Why is the King of Wands here, please? Why is the King of Wands here, please, for Taurus? That's too many cards, Spirit. Can we try again? Why is the King of Wands here, please? Why is the King of Wands here, please? Why is the King of Wands here, please, for Taurus? Thank you. I appreciate it. It says strain it says stranger and nice booty. So someone is having sex with someone that they really don't know on the phone 
while you're at work or vice versa. I'm also getting that someone um, masturbates to the thought of fucking strangers or fucking girls with big butts. Or big dudes that are strangers and dudes with big dicks. Can I get a can I get a card, please? I'm also seeing someone um, masturbating to um, like uh, straight. Uh, what do you call this? Like escort porn. Can I get a card, please, for the King of uh, Pentacles in Reverse? Why is the King of Pentacles in Reverse? Thank you. It says I want it all the time. There's a sexual imbalance. Someone has a strong sexual appetite. Can I, why is the three of wands here? It says whack. Someone wants it all the time, but the, the sex is whack. So then they have to masturbate or they have to go out and fuck strangers or they have to go online and find, you know, strangers meat porn or big booty porn. Big booty holes, twerk with it. No, I'm playing. Uh, and then the overall deck says, I want more foreplay. So I'm also getting that someone doesn't use the mouth. They don't give you head or they don't kiss or something like that. I mean, ain't nobody got time for that. Life's too short. You better get your freak leak on. <laughs>